What's up everybody? Today I'm here at Laguna Lake to throw my lines in the water and see if I can get any fish. Thank you all for watching. Oh, we got him. Might have got him. Flipper dink. Yeah. Flipper dink. There he is. All right. Almost got hooked. That's great. Little dude. Oh man, I got all tangled up. Come on. Ooh, he went for both. I got double drop shot on and look at that. He went for both. I think honestly, the thing that's hooked though, yep, is the trout magnet. He started swimming away with that trout magnet. Nice. Got it back, flipper dink, tiny dude, rip it up. That's what he went for, little trout magnet. Actually, he had both of them in his mouth, but the one he was hooked on was the trout magnet. That was cool. Thought it might have been a trout, but no. Little flipper dink. I want the bigger ones. I saw some bigger ones already, so hopefully we'll get those soon. Got one. We got one. He was trying to take it. It's probably a flipper dink. Let's get low. Let's get low. Got the camera on, I hope. Flipper dink. There he goes. All right. All right, buddy. Thanks for the fight. There he goes. Another little flipper dink. Changed spots, came to the pocket, and that didn't take long. I might throw a little bit more in the pocket or I might move. All right, I had to give the old GoPro a dunkaroo. It shut off again because it was too hot. That happens a lot, but look at this super skinny guy. He looks really unhealthy. He'd be like a pound and a half if he wasn't so dang skinny, but that's a little dude. All right, sorry to bug you, man, and sorry to, uh, not give you the night crawler it doesn't look like he got it all right we'll get him back in maybe he'll beef up soon and we can catch him rip it up i really don't know how i'm going to make it through this whole summer with this gopro i was hoping a lot more out of it but that just doesn't seem possible oh man all my night crawlers got all soaked that's not good when they get too hot they just get all stringy and they start falling apart really so this is what i'm dealing with now I'm trying to dry them off. I had put them in the water and that just really wasn't working. So I'm hoping they'll dry out a little bit. They got way too wet. Maybe we'll be able to save some of them. It's like if I'm in the sun at all for 15, 20 minutes straight and the camera's on, it shuts off because it's too hot. Happened right now and there's a good amount of clouds. It's kind of overcast and it's really not even that hot right now. I don't know how it's going to go. I might have to upgrade and I don't know if there is an upgrade because this is the newest one they make. Ooh, that was a good hit. Missed it. They took it. Maybe though, they're in the same spot. I hope for that. Come on, it's right there. It wasn't too far away. They really got that thing too. I mean, pulled the crud out of it. I didn't even get a chance to pull the trigger. They just took the end of it. And that was it. It's probably because these night crawlers are old and they're getting all stringy. Pulled right off of the hook. Didn't give me a second chance at another bite. I've already gotten a couple of bites just out of the few casts that I've done over here in this little pocket at the end of the lake. Who knows? Maybe we'll come across the decent one that we're looking for here. I think my PB here is probably like two pounds only. Nothing crazy. Let's get a bigger one. Come on now. Here we go. Little nibble. There it is. Did we get him? I think we got him. I think we got him this time. Here we go. We'll go Captain Mo. The old Captain Morgan. We'll get him in here. Feels a little bit bigger than the last one at least. Keep the rod tip low. Fill a couple little head shakes. Nothing crazy. 
Ah, it's about the same, dude. I lied. Maybe not. Maybe a tiny bit bigger. Oh, yeah. A little bit bigger. Not bad. It's a little bit bigger one we're looking for. Can we get him in? I flipped his head wrong. That was tight. Again. I think he really went for it, though. All right. Let's see if we can land him. I don't want to get hooked. Come on. Alright. He has that red on his mouth. Come on, come on, buddy. I want to get hooked. There it is. Got him. There's a little two pounder I was looking for. Awesome. This little pocket's got him. And they're eating probably crawdads. Look at the red around his mouth. That's what I hear that they're going after crawdads when that happens. But we got a decent one, finally. I was just talking about it, the two pounder that I needed. I think that's it. I think that's the two. Looks good. He has uh, something else in there. Broke off somebody. I should probably try to get it out for him. I might help him out, see if we can. It's still in there, sorry buddy. He broke somebody else off, but let's get him back in. Look at that, decent guy. Rip it up, thanks for the fight. All right, my night crawler mound right here look at that they're all drying out i mean they were so wet now they're gonna dry out problem is you got to keep them cool so even though they're gonna dry out they're still kind of hot out in the sun we got a little bit of reprise right now because there is small amount of clouds in the sky hopefully that'll keep up and we can get at these fish for the last couple of minutes here my night crawlers don't all the way die we got a little video going here let's see if i can close it out make that full 10 minute range by the time i gotta leave which is probably like 10 minutes i really don't have too long let's do it i gotta go pick up the misses we got one bass over at the other spot had no other hits i think it was only that one bite i noodled that trout that was really cool here we go we got another one wow two casts in a row they're loaded up here guys captain mo keep them low see if it was the same guy or there's just a pool of them out there. A whole school of them out there. A whole shoal of them. There it is, flipper dink. Got him. Come on, flipper. We're gonna make this video, guys. Look at the red, too. Man, I have these crawdads, but why change when this is working so well? Two casts in a row? That ain't bad. Here, we'll give him that night crawler. So he could beef up a little bit. We'll catch him later. Rip it up. 10 minute warning. Let's get a one more at least. That last one was a little clefty. He was kind of tore up on one of the sides of his mouth was open up. Poor dude. He was still kicking though. And he wasn't skinny either. I gave him that night crawler. Hopefully he'll beef up. Maybe he'll heal up. Five minute warning. Let's hope we get one more. We're so close to that limit. We've pretty much converted every bite. I don't know if I've gotten a bite yet that I didn't get. I don't know if I've gotten a bite yet that I didn't get on shore. Let's see. Can we do it? Five minute warning. I really can't move anywhere. Kind of want to maybe even go back where I caught that first one. Man, that was pretty good for like a little 15 minute stint right here. We we're ripping it up. Three bass in this little corner alone. And then we had one on that other bank and that trout when I was walking over to the other bank. That was kind of cool, little noodling action. But can we close it out? I'm trying hard, guys. I put on a crawdad, double drop shot. One of them's a crawdad, one of them's a night crawler. Threw that scent on them. It's like a shad crawdad scent. So let's hope it might work one more time. All right, we did not get that bass limit. Tried, tried real hard, but we gotta go pick up the misses. Not too bad. Decent little day over here, rip it up. Decent little couple of hours here. I came from another lake, like I said, where I did pretty good, and what do you know, I did decent here too. Did not get the limit, but didn't do bad at all. Got a two pounder, couple of dinks, maybe a one and a one and a half. 
really decent day. So if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like it from Laguna Lake and all over Southern California, subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful day and be well. Peace.